I don't know what else I can do. She's written off the friendship as it stands. You've done what you can do. We've gone about everything we can in the most respectful way. Or do you just think that we need to just forget about it and just... And just kiss? Do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. Yeah, 10 out of 10. I mean, 5 out of 10. <laughs> Sorry, I got excited. <laughs> You've got room for improvement, but 10 for effort, 5 for execution. Um, so we'll try again, mate. We'll try again up. later, maybe. <laughs> yeah, I think it's all just probably quite real now. Like, I'm moving out. It's definitely, like, upsetting, so it just feels like I've lost somebody who I thought was one of my best friends. And I don't, I don't feel like she gives a fuck. Like, she doesn't, really. And, like, yeah. she's not going to reach out to me, so I'm going to... I got that. I'm gonna gonna go and also, her. I totally understand why you're feeling this way. I get it. Actually, me getting involved was a bad idea because I did it because I wanted to support you and I would always support you, and I thought, actually... I don't know how this has, like, happened. I don't, I don't know what's... I think the reason I was just sort of like putting up a wall is because I was like, surely at some point, like, sh that, like, someone's going to be like, this isn't right. Like, this has gone too far. I thought Emily and I were true friendships. But you are. No, we're not. But you, but you, Jimmy, you... we aren't. That's what, that's what this is. This whole reason I'm here now is to realise we aren't. I need to get over it. She didn't think of me as a true friend. Because, say, Emily, I, I was your friend. Well, for my side, I was your friend, so I don't understand this. And I think that. Saying all these things and being totally honest, because, baby, you... you. I am being totally honest. Yeah, but... She knows I don't want to spell what is the point. It's a lost battle It's not now. a lost battle. Yes, this is... it is. I'm so fucking bored talking yes, about baby, it. I know, I know, I know. She's dating my ex-boyfriend. Like, what is the point in me saying that But, 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 but perhaps, perhaps, uh, perhaps what will happen is they will... They will end up, like you and I, falling in love and potentially going out, and actually, then maybe the, the, that's what will happen. Yeah, I'm sure it will, which is why I'm like, that's what, what, do you, what are you wanting me to do? I just, I just, I just think, I just don't know, I just think being completely fine... I am being com what, com be fine with Saying, it. Saying, like, I we're am... not going to be friends, but, like... I'm not going to go say that. I'm going to say, let's put this to bed. But you're going to hold a grudge. That's what you're doing, because you're saying to Emily... So, no, I'm not saying that. Listen, I will say it one more time to you. I am going to her to go, I hope you and Harvey are happy. Can we please have respect for each other and stop talking about it? Let's, let's leave it at that. Is that holding a grudge? No. Do you feel that betrayed and that upset about the situation that you can't see a friendship? Yes. OK. I'm just going to go see her and just, like, just finish it and just, like, put an end to, like, everyone talking about it and just try and move on, like, in a more positive way because it's just, like, upsetting everybody now. Yeah, it really is. It's just horrible. Are you feeling nervous? No. No, are you? I think, I think it's well overdue. It's needed. Mm. I hope, though, that it's not going to be, like, aggressive or... Turn into an argument. I, I quite was, want us all just to now understand each other and just move on from everything. Yeah, I think that's how it will be. I think that's why she's coming down. No, I've dragged you. Well, this is dragged. Hi. Mm. Hi. Hello. Hey. How are you? Good, thank you. So I just thought that we should probably just all meet and like draw a line under things. It's, it's just the whole thing's really uncomfortable and awkward. But, like, it obviously has really upset me and I have found it really uncomfortable and, like, I did think of you as one of my best friends. But even, like, aside of that, I just think it all needs to stop because it's just, like, turned into some, like, horrible, nasty mess. Yeah. No, I agree. I don't want to... I'm, I'm just, like, feeling as stressed about the whole situation as you are. I don't ever want to speak negative for you. I've had nothing bad to say about you. This whole situation has, like, fully upset me as well. Like, when you said, like, that you didn't want to be my friend, that you didn't read the letter, which I know you think that... I just think, you know... I didn't, I didn't really I know what just, else like, to I do. didn't read the letter just because it had been so long having you not spoken to me and I'd, like, moved out and I was like, I can't believe she's not, like, even just dropped me a message. The reason why is why I didn't speak to you before is just because I thought... I just want to... You told me that you didn't want to hear about it, you didn't want to know me, you don't, You just said, I don't... You know, it's done, I don't... I don't basically want to talk to you. So I thought, oh, I'll just let the dust settle. We're hot-headed, so I thought, I'll just wait a little bit and then I can explain to you, like, you know, 
like, I know Emily really is upset and wants to make it all right. And she feels like maybe she, you know, she's done what she thought was right. I'm just confused why it's such an issue to you. I don't get what well, you're, you're saying, that like, you just don't... I, well, think I, just, maybe I get if, that it's if, awkward, if but I don't feel like it should break you... you two guys up as a friendship. I just, I, and I, honestly, if I was probably someone watching from the outside, I would probably be like, oh, surely this isn't... But when it happens to you, and I feel so bad because I've done this to people, when I was in the other seat, I was like, I don't get what the big deal is. And Jamie was the same with Sam. But when it's happening to you, it's, it's really horrible. And for I whatever think... reason, it, it just is. I thought Emily and I were really, really close. So I wrote you a letter, Sophie. I live in your house. I moved you, all my stuff You don't stuff live out. in my house, Sophie. You yeah, haven't been there. Yeah, because of you. Because no, you, you aren't there anyway. I was trying to have, to have yes. this, like, a really nice, calm situation. I just want, basically, everyone to stop speaking about it. It's not going the way I thought it should, but... Don't, Sophie, don't walk off. Let's... Am I a terrible person? I actually can't. I, I can't work it out if I've just done something really bad there. Just there or the whole? Just everything. No. 